From the Land of Green Ghosts, A Burmese Odyssey, by Pascal Ku Thu is a captivating and poignant memoir that offers readers a deeply personal and vivid account of life in Burma, now Myanmar, under a repressive military regime. Thu's narrative takes us on a journey from his humble rural beginnings to his remarkable experiences as a student activist and his eventual escape from his war-torn homeland. Thu begins his memoir by painting a vivid picture of his idyllic childhood in a traditional Padong village. He skillfully describes the lush landscapes, vibrant traditions, and captivating folk tales that shaped his early years. However, as the military regime tightens its grip on the country, Thu's tranquil existence is shattered. The author's depiction of the atrocities committed by the military against the ethnic minorities in Burma is both heart-wrenching and eye-opening. Through his intimate and emotional storytelling, Thu exposes the brutal reality of the Burmese dictatorship, highlighting the fear, oppression, and loss experienced by his people. The narrative then shifts focus to Thu's university years where he becomes deeply involved in the pro-democracy movement. He becomes an activist, fueled by a desire to challenge the regime and fight for freedom and justice. Thu's account of his involvement in the student protests is a testament to the unwavering determination and courage of the Burmese people. He vividly captures the palpable tension and danger that surrounded these demonstrations, leaving readers on the edge of their seats. Amidst the chaos and political turmoil, Thu's passion for literature becomes a guiding force. He discovers the works of English poet John Donne, which not only provide solace in his darkest moments but also ignite a burning desire to pursue his own education abroad. The author's exploration of his literary journey adds depth and nuance to the narrative, offering a glimpse into the power of literature as a means of resistance and self-discovery. Thu's memoir also delves into the intricacies of his encounters with various individuals who shape his life and worldview. From his enigmatic encounter with a spiritual hermit to his friendships with fellow dissidents, Thu beautifully captures the complexity of human relationships amidst adversity. These personal anecdotes add a layer of authenticity to the memoir making it more than just a political account but a testament to the strength of human spirit and connection. Ultimately, From the Land of Green Ghosts is a captivating memoir that transcends its political backdrop. Thu's lyrical prose and evocative storytelling draw readers into the heart of Burma, allowing them to witness the resilience and spirit of its people. Through his personal odyssey, Thu sheds light on a country plagued by oppression while celebrating its rich cultural heritage and the power of literature. The memoir serves as a testament to the strength of the human spirit and the indomitable will to fight for freedom and justice, even in the face of unimaginable adversity. In conclusion, Pascal Ku Thu's From the Land of Green Ghosts a Burmese Odyssey is a powerful and moving memoir that offers a poignant glimpse into life in Burma under a repressive military regime. Thu's vivid storytelling, compelling personal anecdotes, and profound insights make this memoir an unforgettable reading experience, shedding light on the resilience and courage of the Burmese people.